My fan's on. It's pretty loud. Yep, that's about right. Hello, people. My name is Absolutely Spooky. My real name is Kurt. And uh, in case you didn't pick up on it from the other two videos I did, I work anime conventions sometimes. I worked another, another anime convention. And I'm going to be talking about exactly that right now. So before we get too much into really what happened, how it went down, uh, I want to show you some pictures. Usually I don't get pictures with cosplayers or people because uh, I'm running around so much I just, I don't have time to set up a picture instead of just, you know, some low quality video. But from time to time I'll get some images and I got a couple at Colossal Con East. I got a picture of Kiba. I got a picture of Boozette. Panty and Stocking, there they are, Kiba, Hornet from Shovel Knight, that one was actually pretty nice, Kiba, and Demon. So before the con started, we actually loaded everything into the truck to transport it, and before we got on the road, we as a company stopped at a buffet, got some food, it was pretty nice, here's the truck, not incredible, and here's just some shots from the road that I thought were fairly interesting. Here we are actually arriving at the con center. It was quite a lengthy drive, took a while to get there. Elephant, yeehaw. And then we spent some time taking everything off the truck, and that is a difficult and lengthy process, and it is not fun. Here's the room filled with all the crap that was stuffed on the truck. It's truly just an obscene amount of materials. Here's a video clip of a tree. I don't know, I thought it was cool, but I sped it up because it was a very long shot. Here we have dealer's room before all the dealers got in to sell their stuff, and here's a video clip from the room I was in of the actual water park and surrounding grounds of Kalahari. The next morning I went with Juliana here, and we went and picked up breakfast for everybody, and then started putting crap together, and it was, it was quite a hassle. Here's Cogley again, you might remember him from previous videos. Here's some fun little snippet clippets of the video game arcades in the video game room that we have going on, as well as some very, very bad footage of the inside of the new Kalahari Convention extension that is being built in the Poconos Mountains Kalahari Resort. Here's a fun shot I've got going on. I like this shot because in it, you can see Professor Shy Guy, the Super Guitar Brothers, and CG5 all hanging out. <gasps> Here we have the arcades up and running with some people doing their thing at them. No idea how any of these machines work. Never actually tried them. I didn't really have anything much past that. I went back to my room, you know, went to sleep for the night. Here we have Kiba again. There he is. Here's some people, really just a whole bunch of them. Here is Staff Suite, where essentially uh, if you work for staff and you're bored or hungry or just want to get away from the crowd, you just come hang out in here. They're playing Avatar the entire weekend on the TV, they play Avatar, and then they just like always have grilled cheeses, so it's pretty gamer. Here's some clips of the Super Thrash Brothers, didn't actually manage to capture audio of that, but you know, here they are. Here's me once again manning the big boy toys, that's a fun activity, always enjoy that task. And here's some other shots of those aforementioned musicians just doing their thing, you know. Now we get to the rave, which is arguably, as far as cons go, one of the most important parts. Here's me being behind the scenes because Kagwe had to go to the bathroom and he basically just wanted me to make sure nobody started screwing with his materials. And here are some people really just getting into it. Kiba, this is the Otaku Fui Market. As I mentioned before, basically you just drop in with some stuff you found in your closet. You can try to sell it. I actually managed to sell some stuff that I had just lying around. Uh, none of it had anything to do with anime. It was like a microphone and a Razer keyboard. But I did get like 60 bucks that day, which was, uh, that was nice because I wasn't expecting to get anything. And I didn't really get too much actual footage. Uh, here's us, you know, putting everything back in the truck. And here is the remnant corpse of what was once 13 as constructed by the balloon guy, I believe his name was. I don't know, and I'm not going to fact check myself. But he made 13, and uh, here we are killing it. Oh my god, she tore off 13's feet. <laughs> More than anything, I want to push you over right now. Went to bed for that one last night. Uh, woke up the next morning, left, went home. Uh, it was just another adventure. It was another con. Kind of really looking forward to the next one, which should be Ichiban in January. 
Nothing really fancy happened. This was the staff shirt. It has uh, Samus on it. It's pretty cool, I guess, you know? Yeah, the end, I guess. See you at Ichiban.